Hey everybody, it's Topwater Johnny, and in this lure review slash fishing, we're going to be fishing with an inline spinner to see if we can really get bass to bite it. Let's check it out. Whoa, there we go. Yeah! Woo, holy cow, folks. Topwater Johnny here, man. This is what we came here for. Look at that. Get back here. That right there. That's the kind of beast that we came here for. Hey everybody, it's Top Water Johnny. Look at that beast right there, baby. I think I won the tournament with that one right there. I am the one with this one. Hey everybody, it's Top Water Johnny here. Just want to welcome you to this lure review and fishing here. As you saw in the intro there, we're going to be fishing with and inline spinner in this video. Now, as a bass fisherman, you know me as top water Johnny, and normally I'm doing all top water. But <clears throat> there's a time in my life where I used to do a lot more diversity of fishing. I used to still do a lot of variety of types of fishing before I really tried to focus in on just top water. Well, a while back, I went out and did some fishing, and I did it because I had received kind of as a gift this inline spinner kit now in the video you're going to be watching me fish with this particular one right here this inline spinner and in, actually inline spinner right here and it is actually pretty much to me at first when i saw this i really underestimated the power of an inline spinner because i never really used one before but i actually got a kit and it was a gift and as you can see right here all of these inline spinners right here so when i received this kind of like as a little bit of a gift and i kept telling myself exactly what am i going to do with this you know i don't really fish with inline spinners i'm down here in florida and you know pretty much i wasn't sure if i could catch any fish on it well lo and behold the inline spinner is a great lure and when those bass are kind of deep and they're kind of off the bank a little bit. And it's kind of hard to catch them. An inline spinner really does have a lot of flash. It brings them up, gets you noticed by bass and by panfish. So what I realized was that when I'm reeling this, it's that little Colorado blade, right? Like little Colorado blade right there that's spinning really aggressively that's getting those bass to notice it. And so what I realized was that this is a powerful thing. So when I looked at my selections, I said, which one to pick? Which one should I actually fish with? So I just decided to go with this one because I knew that it was yellow, which is chartreuse, and it had silver here. So I figured that flash would mimic a fleeing minnow. So that's what I did, and that's what I'm fishing with. So what I wanted to do here was just kind of give you a little bit of information on this footage here. This is a lure review but really it's a lure review in action. So you'll actually watch me fish and you'll see me be fishing with it and actually close out the video fishing. So once again, I just wanted to thank everybody for liking, subscribing to the channel. Please be sure and hit that bell notification as well because a lot of people aren't getting notified when I'm releasing these and they're missing that kind of that big release. And if you don't hear about it soon enough, then it seems like I'm getting buried inside of the search results. So if you hit the bell notification, I'm hoping that you'll get notified early enough. You can come over and watch it. So thank you so much. Enjoy the video. And as always, remember that phrase, keep your line tight because when they hit those top water lures and when they hit this little spinner, it could be a good bite. All right. There we go. There we go. There we go, everybody. All right. There we go. Oh, oh God. Ah, he threw it. He threw the inline spinner. Ah. Oh, God. He threw it.
There we go. 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 All right. On the spinner there, everybody. On the spinner. Not bad here. Okay. Been trying to get one. Not exactly top water action at the moment, but we got one here and we got him on the spinner. So I'm going to have to take that one for right now. All right. All right, everybody. That's a nice little fat one right there on the spinner. All right. There we go. There we go. There we go. Nice little bluegill. Chasing minnows. And we got that one right there. All right. So no complaints. There's that inline spinner once again. All right. Nice little bluegill. Nice fat bluegill there. All right, then. You didn't get a chance to see this one right here, everybody. There's one, everybody. You can see it there, hooked on that inline spinner. want to give a shout-out to Real 817 Fishing Team, just showing them that we can make it happen also on that inline spinner. All right, then. So just a shout-out to everybody. Here we go. Here we go. There we go. There we go, everybody. Woo! I'm on fire now. There is another one. Oh. On that. There's another one, everybody. On that inline, on that inline spinner. They are tearing that inline spinner up. So I am like really, really excited about this. All right. There you go, everybody. One nice one right there, fat one on that inline spinner. So just wanted to show everybody. All right, then. So once again, appreciate all the love and the follows and the likes. And we'll just keep on doing it. All right, then. There we go. There we go. Right on the fall. Right there. there we go. Nope. And I appreciate it for the cameraman. That is what I came here to get for this film. <laughs> All right. On the spinner, we got our first, got a nice little bass here on that spinner. And that spinner is working great. 
this morning so no complaints here and for those that are thinking about that spinner here's a good example of it how effective it is at locking down and making that hit all right there you go a nice little one on the spinner so no complaints hey everybody it's top water johnny here well the grind was real today here everybody i was using that inline spinner in order to make it happen those fish are hiding deep i need some flash they are chasing so i use that inline spinner today to really make it happen and to make those fish bite so i had some really good catches today i was really happy about that and you always have to be out here adapting following different focus thinking about new ways to catch them when your usual ways don't work so as always please like subscribe to the channel hit the bell notification and always remember my phrase when it comes to fishing keep your line tight because when they hit that lure it's gonna be a big bite all right